Nonlinear and Autonomous Systems Laboratory at Michigan Tech presents Guppy, Glider for Underwater Problem Solving and Promotion of Interest in Engineering. Guppy is an educational tool that can be used for middle school through graduate level studies. It engages STEM interest, teaches students about robotics, and can be used to do scientific research. Microgliders. Guppy is a great outreach tool to start the conversations for kids of all ages about underwater gliders. When doing a short educational session, microgliders can be used to teach the concept of movement through gravity and buoyancy through popsicle sticks and paper clips. It is a simple and engaging learning tool. The In-Depth Guppy program teaches students about the full engineering process from imagining, designing, building, through testing, and how to improve on it. Computer-aided design software, or CAD, is introduced to show how engineers accurately design parts. Guppy incorporates 3D printed parts designed through CAD. Students then learn about coding and wiring using a tiny processor called an Arduino. They learn how circuits work, program simple commands, and then work on completing small challenges like making LED lights blink, actuating a small motor, or incorporating sensors. Mini Guppy is the small, hands-on underwater glider that is simple to build. This design uses a syringe to suck in water to control buoyancy and can be customized with student-designed fins and tails. Students write code to make their buoyancy engine take in and push out water in specific time intervals. They also solder and assemble the electronics. It is then all placed in a small clear tube that seals to be watertight. Super Guppy allows for more opportunities to explore. The larger acrylic frame allows for more room for payloads such as sensors or cameras. It has a pinion and rack system to control buoyancy and can also be modeled on a computer. This guppy can be incorporated into higher level learning for more in-depth projects. Students can also be challenged to come up with ideas on how guppy could be used in real life situations to help solve problems. Guppy gets a final test in the pool. Students get to see if their guppy locomotes in the sawtooth motion. Here's how it works. I'm going to take a picture with you. Guppy, we love oh, no, you. your camera doesn't work. We love you, Guppy. I did learn a lot about different capabilities of robots, such as the Guppy with its buoyancy control. I thought that was really interesting. It was really fun. I really was not expecting to go swimming with it, but it was cool to see how our Guppy is interacting with the water. And I don't know, it was just, it was interesting to actually put it into practice. Like, it's one thing learning something, but it's completely different when you actually see how you can apply it. 